Hello, it's Christine. I'm wearing my new Faith shirt. Can you see it? Can you see? With my skirt. It's pretty loose. Got my um, turban style head covering on and I'm walking my doggy. My new doggy, new poochie. Hello, chat. Want to say hello? Hello, hello. I don't know. I don't know if y'all can see him. Anywho, um, what did I want to talk about? I wanted to talk about the day in the life of a homeschool head covering um, helpmate and housewife. What does that look like? Well, I get up, chit chat with my hubby. A lot of times, either while we're praying, while I'm praying, or before I pray, or right after I pray. And um, I like to read um, in the Word first thing and then I go out read the Bible with the children and then we start our individual um, subjects that they're working on usually math first and then the rest uh, we do chores I'll pray I'll um, make their meals or food prep sometimes they'll help me make juices because of the way I eat y'all know and um, yeah, then we'll usually go meet a friend. This dog is stopping to do something. Anywho, then we'll go meet a friend or just go walk um, at a park or a playground or go to the library. And the Lord usually gives me an opportunity to minister to somebody, share the gospel, you know, fellowship um, with other brothers and sisters in Christ through, um, I don't know, gathering at a local salad joint or... Um, definitely with other sisters who homeschool because we have time and you know if they're not in my vicinity or um, we just can't get together that day then we'll use Marco Polo or we'll um, call one another and spur one another on <laughs> and so I just wanted to tell you sorry it was garbage day so if you see the garbage cans all around the neighborhood that's why um, Seek the Lord, inquire of him about what your life is to look like. Are you living out his purpose for you? Are you living out his divine perfect will for your life? Um, this is a time of Purim and fasting and turning around what um, the enemy's plan was for you and your bloodline through prayer and warfare. I'm going to turn this way just because there's somebody over there and I don't want them to think she's talking to her phone. Um, and yeah. So I think it's vital in these last days. I think it's urgent and important for us to, um, here comes a car, of course. I think it's urgent and important for us to uh, make the most of every opportunity. I've spoken about this um, on these videos before, knowing that days are evil and that um, we are number our days right so that we can gain a heart of wisdom. I'm out here walking my dog right now because I like to pray and I like to talk to the Lord and I just happen to make this video. But my children are winding down for the day. Daddy's finishing up projects. I call him Daddy. He can't, my husband, Aaron, is finishing up projects in the backyard because he got off of work. And usually we'd eat together. Um, but I picked up food for my kiddos on the way home. And um, then we'll just settle down for the night. Maybe we'll sing hymns. We'll read together. We'll watch some type of Christian uplifting um, video or movie and then they'll get a book read to them and my husband and I will hang out before bed and maybe we'll read a book together and just catch up with one another. So that's my typical day in the life of Christine here. Um, I don't feel like it's so different than anyone else who doesn't wear head coverings and you know doesn't wear skirts or whatnot but when we're home we have time we have grace and there is space and margin to abide and so I just want you to um, really petition the Lord for that because he wants to give you it he wants to give you rest in him and peace and joy Shalom